WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 9 a.m. update. And currently, we've got the U.S. equity futures trading to the downside, not by much, 8.08%. Uh, the Dow's off 24. The NASDAQ 100 is uh, down 10. The uh, ES Mini is off 3. And the Russell is down 2 points. You, last night in Asia, you had uh, uh, the Asian markets close higher. Australia closed off by 56 points. And right now, Europe is trading just slightly higher. Gold's off three bucks, silver's down uh, nine pennies, and light sweet crude is off 24 cents. But let's go really get a feel, intraday-wise, what is going on with these markets. So we're going to switch over to a number of 30-minute time frame charts and uh, get a feel for what these markets are communicating to us. The upper... The upper four charts are the equity future contracts. You got the ES, the NQ, the Dow, and the Russell 2000. Each of those put in TD9 count bottom. So these are the levels to be watching today to the downside 34, 513 in the Dow, 15, 458.25 in the NQ, 44, 48.25 in the ES, and in the Russell, it's 22, 16, 50. Those are the numbers to be paying attention to. If price closes below those, below those levels, we run lower out here. Um, you know, that's that's what the signal would be. Now, what well, we have our actual bottom. So I gave you those lows out here. This is signaling that the ES mini should go target 44.72. The NQ, 15,527. The YM, 34,710. And the Russell, the 22,320 level. Gold right now is trading below its TD9 breakout level of 1753.70. If it stays below that, we go back and we retest yesterday's lows. Maybe it's even worse than that. Silver has support at 2268. Those support levels are their TD9 breakout areas. The U.S. dollar index right now is trading up into resistance on a 30-minute basis. That is its oscillator and change line. If price stays below that, uh, then we should see gold and silver hold these levels. Light sweet crude should go target the 7228 area. That, too, put in a TD nine count bottom. So we have Five of these eight charts have got those TD nine count bottoms, folks. If you'd like to learn the TD nine count pattern, and you really do, just simply subscribe to Mastering Probability. You can do that for 29 days, uh, basically uh, free, with no risk to you whatsoever. But stay tuned. Tommy O'Brien is up next. I'm sure it's going to be a great hour. Stay with us here today and have a uh, fantastic weekend, folks. Tune in to the Trader's Edge at 1 o'clock. Uh, that'll be the show we just recorded, but 1 o'clock on Monday, that'll be live. Take care, folks.